beautiful morning this morning. It's a little bit uh, cloudy and um, a little bit of a drizzle out there. So I think we'll take the ute. Oh, it's good to see the centre drone between us and the neighbours quite low. And quite uh, rare to see as I got in the paddock without um, most of the cows getting up and out of bed. Come on! Usually I can't get in the paddock, they're rushing out that much, that um, fast, but this morning I drove in. It's not usually happen. Oh no, there's those all little buttercups growing. They're our main um, weed that grows for our pasture we have um, issues with. And the peat loves to grow everywhere. So um, what we do is, um, if it gets too bad, we actually tend to mulch them. Get our mulcher out, mulch them in. Ladies, come on, lady, come on. Yeah, they're at the cow shed now. It's just a matter of pushing them in the yard. They're not the easiest cows to push in the yard. <laughs> Especially when they're full. Come on. Come on. Come on, you. All right, I'll see you at milking. Morning. Yeah, she's going to be a cracker of a day and a bit of rain this afternoon tonight. Doesn't get any better for a nice warm spring day. Look at these girls away. It's going well. Yeah, it's just finished washing the yard. How are you going today? Morning. Good morning. Yeah, getting it done. Feeding the only mob of calves to feed now. Looking good. I've just put a bomb through the vat. Now I'm about to put the last little rip cycle through. That's an acid that goes through now. Cold acid to finish off. Dad's out there. He's just finished washing the cafeteria. And uh, yeah, about a half the uh, uh, half the circle to go. Nearly done. Almost the bullies. How are we doing, eh? Oh, are looking good. Looking big. Girls are looking good today. We got a good paddock. No need for silage. Yeah, we got a. Uh, got our four, five, six, six bags of meal today. Wakey Massey, you've had the weekend off. Time to get you back up again. We'll give her a quick grease up and we'll go spread some uh, more food. I got my paddock list. I got my paddock list. We're ready to go. Grease are up. As the saying goes, grease is cheap. Oh, let's go. Cheap as that's a rig there. Got a nice tractor too. Keeps it clean. <laughs> going flat knackers today jeepers he's had a truck pull in and go out he's really had a spread out he opened at 8 30 it's just gone nine jeepers. one full truck load one spreader and we're the next spreader here jeepers. well he's going well he's got his phone going off the hook to the poor bugger keep it up Paul
loaded. We're off to go and uh, spread out on the farm and then we'll come back and get another two and a half tonne of clay mix. Let's get a move on. Paddock down is one of our bigger paddocks. I think it's about 1.9 hectares. Our biggest paddock is 2.3 and our smallest paddock is 1.3. So yeah, there we go. Yeah, it's gone down a little bit. Into the next one. Yay, distance away from the drain. Rims. Keep power down. So what that button does there, that A, that sets our revs. I've got them set at the moment at 1500. So I don't have to do the throttle at all. It just does the revs for us. Loads going down well. Two paddocks down. We've got a few more to go. This is a fun paddock to get into. Especially from this way. We're going in the one on the right. This is where the race is at its um, is at its smallest. Gonna take a couple of bites at it. Two today. I got it in two today. It's a wide gateway, but it's the race is literally another half a meter wider than the tractor there. So um, yeah, it's definitely fun to get the the ripper down. It's a hard spot for the ripper to get through. You literally only have about an inch of room on each side. We've got one more little bit to do, and it'll be kind of speed ahead. Easy getting out this way. There's a clay bank that runs right through to that power line there. And so this side here is peat and that side is clay. And we're doing the peat today. So we'll do a little triangle in here. Quite a big triangle. And then um, let's go get our load of clay because I think that'll do us. Yeah, that'll probably do us. So that was quite lucky. We did run out just as we finished. We did an extra about 10 meter run. Perfect. Well, we'll take it back and let's go get a load of uh, clay mix. You guys look happy? hasn't been with me this morning he went uh, obviously you've been hunting haven't you look at you you're covered in mud so now he's happy he's coming with me to the fur works It's good. Dad, I, Dad's gone down. He's closed all the gates, or majority of the gates. She's washed and parked up. Hey, it's time for breakfast. Yep. Oh. We'll see you all at milking tonight. Afternoon. Yeah, it looks like there could be some rain coming. Good, we got that fur on. Uh, Dad's just gone down to go get the cows in. They're on their way up now. And, um,. We've also got the tankers just arrived. That's all good. 
we'll go and um, wash the vet now. See if there he's done. goes. Thank you, Mr. Tiger Man. All right. Let's wash this vet now. The rinse through now, because, uh, yeah, we're going to be lucky if we can do it before the cows get back. Do a full bomb wash. Yeah, let's see what we did production wise. We did 5,607 litres. That's up, that's good. Not too bad. I'll finish washing this vat and I'll see you all at Malkin. There we go, that's three rows down. We've got 10 cows to catch that we know of. Four in there now. We've got four in the next row and two still out in the yard. Feels going down well and there's a good little storm rolling across over there. It's gonna miss us. Last row of two, so the um a bit fuller tonight, so they push through to the end of this row and squeeze them into the last row. We've got ten out there for uh, Gordon to come and put some nice little carvies in. Oh well uh keep moving. Another successful mating, ten kales done. Dad is uh just washing up. I'm about to put the acid through. I've already done the rinse cycle. See you, Gordon. We'll catch you tomorrow. Here goes, Gordon. And we're... See you, Dad. See you tomorrow, Dad. Yep. I'm off to go and feed out uh, one bale of silage. They haven't got enough grass for tonight, but because it's going to be a dirty night, we'll uh, take a bale of silage down. Give them a bit extra. Coming, Eric. There's Dad. Just feeding the calves their uh, bag of pellets. Four, ba four bales left on the trailer. And we've got our bale for tonight. Coming, Eric. The girls have their silage. And they're happy. Well, like and subscribe. And I'll see you all in the morning. Thank you.